Compost, the earthy, crumbly substance that emerges from a pile of kitchen scraps and yard waste. It's a transformation that turns what we consider waste into something incredibly valuable. It might seem like magic, but it's actually a fascinating biological process. This process involves countless microorganisms, insects, and worms working together to break down organic material. Compost is more than just decomposed organic matter, it's a treasure trove of life. Within it, a complex web of organisms thrives, each playing a crucial role in the decomposition process. It holds the key to unlocking the true potential of our soil, leading to healthier plants, bigger yields, and a more sustainable future. By enriching the soil, compost helps retain moisture, reduce erosion, and improve soil structure. Compost is teeming with beneficial microorganisms that form the foundation of a healthy soil ecosystem. These microorganisms help to suppress plant diseases and pests, reducing the need for chemical fertilizers and pesticides. These tiny creatures are the unsung heroes of our gardens and farms. Earthworms, for instance, aerate the soil and create channels that allow roots to penetrate deeper. They work tirelessly to break down organic matter, releasing nutrients in a form readily available to plants. This continuous cycle of decomposition and nutrient release is what makes compost so effective. In essence, compost acts as both a natural fertilizer and a soil conditioner. It enriches the soil with essential nutrients, improves its structure, and promotes a healthy ecosystem, ensuring that our gardens and farms thrive. We often think of soil as just dirt, an inert substance beneath our feet. However, healthy soil is a vibrant, living ecosystem. It's a complex web of interconnected organisms, from microscopic bacteria and fungi to earthworms and insects. These organisms play vital roles in maintaining soil fertility and structure, ultimately supporting plant life. Imagine the soil as a bustling city, with each organism playing a specific role. Bacteria are the decomposers, breaking down organic matter into simpler compounds. Fungi act as the networkers, connecting plant roots and transporting nutrients. Earthworms are the engineers, aerating the soil and improving drainage. Together they create a thriving community that sustains plant growth. Microorganisms are the invisible workforce of the soil, tirelessly carrying out essential tasks that keep the ecosystem functioning. Bacteria are the most abundant, responsible for decomposing organic matter and releasing nutrients like nitrogen. Fungi form symbiotic relationships with plant roots, extending their reach for water and nutrients. Protozoa and nematodes are also important players in the soil food web. Protozoa graze on bacteria, releasing excess nutrients in a plant-available form. Nematodes consume bacteria, fungi, and other nematodes, further contributing to nutrient cycling. This intricate web of interactions ensures that nutrients are constantly being recycled and made available to plants. Nutrient cycling is the process by which nutrients move from the soil to plants and back again. It's a continuous loop fueled by the activity of soil organisms. When plants die or shed leaves, they fall to the ground providing food for decomposers. These decomposers break down the organic matter, releasing nutrients back into the soil. Plants then absorb these nutrients through their roots, using them for growth and development. This cycle continues, ensuring a constant supply of nutrients for generations of plants. Compost plays a crucial role in this process by providing a readily available source of organic matter for decomposers to feed on. Section 5. Carbon, the backbone of plant life. While we often focus on nitrogen, phosphorus, and potassium as essential plant nutrients, carbon is equally important. Plants obtain carbon from the atmosphere through photosynthesis, using it to build their tissues and produce energy. In fact, carbon makes up about 50% of a plant's dry weight. Compost adds carbon to the soil in the form of humus, a stable organic compound that improves soil structure and water retention. Humus acts like a sponge, holding onto moisture and nutrients, making them available to plants over time. By increasing the carbon content of our soils, we can improve their overall health and productivity. Section 6. The Dance of Predators and Prey Maintaining Soil Harmony The soil food web is a delicate balance of predator-prey relationships. Just like in any ecosystem, predators keep populations in check and prevent any one species from dominating. This delicate balance is crucial for maintaining soil health and nutrient cycling. 
For example, nematodes that feed on bacteria help to regulate bacterial populations, preventing them from outcompeting other organisms. These nematodes in turn become food for larger predators like centipedes and spiders. This intricate web of interactions ensures that no one organism becomes too dominant, maintaining a healthy balance within the soil ecosystem. Section 7. Compost Nature's Fertilizer and Soil Enhancer Compost is a gardener's best friend, providing a multitude of benefits for both soil and plants. It is an essential component in sustainable gardening practices, transforming organic waste into a valuable resource. It's a natural fertilizer, releasing nutrients slowly as it decomposes, providing a sustained food source for plants. This slow release ensures that plants receive a steady supply of essential nutrients over time promoting consistent growth and health. Compost also improves soil structure making it looser and more friable, allowing for better root penetration and water infiltration. This enhanced soil structure helps to prevent soil compaction, which can hinder plant growth and water absorption. Furthermore, compost helps to suppress plant diseases and pests by promoting the growth of beneficial microorganisms that compete with harmful ones. These beneficial microbes create a healthier soil ecosystem, reducing the need for chemical pesticides and fertilizers. It also acts as a buffer, protecting plants from extreme temperatures and drought conditions. By retaining moisture and regulating soil temperature, compost helps plants withstand environmental stresses more effectively. In essence, compost is a one-stop shop for creating a healthy and productive garden or farm. Its numerous benefits make it an indispensable tool for any gardener or farmer looking to cultivate a thriving, sustainable landscape. Section 8. Benefits of Compost – A Bounty of Advantages the benefits of using compost are numerous and far-reaching. It's not just about enriching the soil, it's about creating a thriving ecosystem in your garden. By adding compost to our soils, we can improve soil structure. This means better aeration, which allows roots to grow more freely and access the nutrients they need. Compost helps to break up heavy clay soils and improve the drainage of sandy soils. It increases water retention, ensuring that plants have access to moisture even during dry spells. Compost acts like a sponge, holding on to moisture and making it available to plants during dry periods. This is crucial for maintaining plant health and reducing the need for frequent watering. Compost provides a slow and steady release of essential nutrients for plant growth. This means that plants receive a consistent supply of the nutrients they need over time, rather than in short bursts. Compost promotes the growth of beneficial microorganisms that compete with harmful pathogens. These microorganisms help to suppress plant diseases, leading to healthier plants. Reduce the need for chemical fertilizers. By using compost, we can minimize our reliance on synthetic fertilizers, which can be harmful to the environment. Compost provides a natural source of nutrients, reducing the reliance on synthetic fertilizers. This not only benefits the plants but also the surrounding ecosystem. These benefits translate into healthier plants, bigger yields, and a more sustainable approach to gardening and farming. By incorporating compost into our gardening practices, we can create a more resilient and productive garden. Section 9. Beyond Compost – Other Soil Boosting Heroes While compost is a powerful tool for improving soil health, it's not the only one. Other soil amendments such as aged manure, leaf mold and cover crops can also contribute to a thriving soil ecosystem. Aged manure provides a good source of nutrients and organic matter. Leaf mold, as the name suggests, is decomposed leaves offering a wealth of beneficial fungi. Cover crops are plants grown specifically to improve soil health, fixing nitrogen, and adding organic matter. By incorporating a variety of soil amendments, we can create a diverse and resilient soil ecosystem. Section 10. Creating Your Own Compost – A Rewarding Endeavor Creating your own compost is a simple and rewarding process. All you need is a designated area in your yard, a balance of green materials like kitchen scraps and grass clippings, and brown materials like dried leaves and twigs. Layer the green and brown materials in a ratio of about 3 to 1, turning the pile regularly to provide aeration. Over time the materials will decompose transforming into rich dark compost. This process can take anywhere from a few months to a year, depending on the materials used and the environmental conditions. Section 11. Conclusion. Embracing the power of compost and soil biology. 
Compost is more than just decomposed organic matter, it's a key ingredient in creating a healthy and productive garden or farm. By understanding the role of soil biology and the benefits of compost, we can unlock the true potential of our soils. Let's embrace the power of compost and soil biology, working in harmony with nature to create a more sustainable and abundant future. By nurturing our soils, we nurture ourselves and the planet.